Okay, so I've gotten all my petals ready. I have four cups of it. And I'm just gonna show you guys now how to make the dandelion tea. Let the camera around. Here's my four cups of petals. And I have a nice big jar. This is a pickle jar that I just washed. You want you to make sure your jar is nice and clean. Um, and then here's my hot water. And you make it just like you would tea. So I'm just gonna dump my petals in here. Let me put the phone down. Here I am just finishing up putting the petals in. They come out really easily because they all stick together. Try to get the last bit out of here because this was a lot of work, you guys, and you do not want to waste it. All right. Look at that. All the petals in my jar. And all I'm going to do is let me shake it up a little bit because I want to kind of even it out. So when I put the water in there, I can see how much water I'm pouring. So this is four cups of petals, and this is a double batch. Um, for a normal batch, you would do two cups of the flower petals, four cups of water. And since this is four cups of petals, I'm gonna measure out eight cups of water. Just pour it over. You definitely want to make sure that your jar is not like super cold or anything um, due to thermal shock. You don't want your jar to break when you're putting in hot water. Um, I washed mine with warm water and warmed it up a bit. All right, this here goes the second. Look at that pretty collar forming already. That's absolutely gorgeous. And this is why when you um, pick off the petals, you want to leave the green out as much as possible because the more of that green you left in, not only would it make it bitter, but then you would also have like a murky greenish color, not this beautiful, beautiful yellow that we have going. And it's night nighttime right now, um, but I guarantee you this looks much more beautiful in the day. But it's really pretty. So what I'm going to do is... Cover it up. Well, actually, I'm gonna stir this first. I didn't get a stir, but I will stir this after I'm done with the video, and then cover it up, and then I will just let it sit and steep until it gets cool enough um, to put in the fridge. You don't wanna put it hot in the refrigerator. You wanna cool it down to at least room temp, and then I'm just gonna let it sit and steep in the refrigerator overnight. So there you have it. Pretty simple, pretty easy. You make it just like you would normal tea. If you have any questions, let me know. I hope this was helpful. Thank you for watching. Bye.